So I first joined back in October, I think it was about seven months ago. Um, my son was already doing karate here and I was here and I saw the kickboxing classes and they looked interesting and I've been gaining weight steadily over the last 10 years and I wanted to try something new, it looked fun. Um, I used to do karate and um, I decided that I wanted to give it a shot. Uh, you guys were offering a six week like startup challenge thing um, and I thought I would try that to see what it was like. Um, I really, I got a lot out of it. I lost some weight, I felt better, I met some new people, made some friends and um, it, was, it was easy because I could be here, you know, while my son was doing karate, I could do kickboxing at the same time. So I did find myself feeling a little bit like I hit a plateau after a couple of weeks in. I lost a good amount of weight in the beginning and then for like two weeks I didn't see the scale move at all and it was really frustrating because I was sticking to the eating plan and coming to the classes and I messaged Anna, she was my coach, and um, she told me that it's not a plateau unless it's lasting for months and so I was like, oh it's only two weeks, you know, and then literally like three days later the scale started moving again. So. Yeah, that was, that was actually feeling like I overcame that, um, felt really good, and yeah, that was probably the biggest challenge with the most recent spring shred challenge that I did. Awesome. People started noticing the changes in me, and sometimes I don't see it because I see my body every day, but when I hear other people saying, hey Joy, you look ripped. <laughs> Someone actually said that to me. I was like, what? <laughs> that actually made me realize that I was changing and I was um, getting stronger and things that I couldn't see, other people could see. And that felt really good. I've done three of these now. And the most recent one, I felt like it was easier. And I don't know if it's because done it a couple of times already um, but one thing that I did differently this time was I printed out the page um, from Prestige Labs that says this is how much protein you should have every day and how many carbs and I printed that one piece of paper out and I put it on the cabinet in my kitchen and every time I would meal prep I would look at that to remind myself you know this is how many ounces or how many cups I should be consuming and so I was very strict this time with measuring out everything. I feel like that made a big difference in the changes that I've made during this most recent challenge. It's awesome. Cool. Some weight. Um, not as much weight as maybe I look like I've lost because I've gained, gained quite a bit of muscle. And I feel stronger, a lot stronger. Like I can tell when I do X Fit, like do X Fit. Like, I'm just increasing the weight and it's, it's kind of cool to see that. I like um, competition, I kind of thrive on competition and so I see other people in the class lifting and I'm like trying to you know, lift as much as they are and it's, um, it helps push me a little bit to have other people around me in classes. So I've lost some weight, um, not as much weight as maybe I look like I've lost because I've gained, gained quite a bit of muscle. Well, my family is very active. We like going out and doing things. Um, most recently, we went to New Hampshire to Loon Mountain, and we did uh, one of those extreme ninja warrior things just like for fun, just as a family get together. And I was like killing it. Like the rest of my family, <laughs> they were like having trouble struggling on the obstacle course, and I was like feeling really good about it. And uh, my son, he does karate, he was doing really well too, but it felt good to you know, be able to tackle that. And, and I'm just personally, I feel like I'm rambling now. <laughs> no, that was good, that was good, that was good. Um, all right. I would just say, you know, just do it. It's, um, it's fun, you get to meet new people. It doesn't, I feel like it doesn't matter what level your baseline is, there's um, something for everybody. Um, there's modifications for everybody. I probably overdid it a little bit with this most recent 
challenge. Um, I've been struggling with some knee pain, but you can come in with an injury and the instructors here are amazing and they can modify things for you and you can get stronger. I've struggled in the past with foot pain and I've been able to make modifications and gotten past that and that's gone now. Um, next week I'm doing my first 10K and I feel like I can only do this because of the progress I've made while here at Extreme Ninja. Oh. <laughs>